Hi everyone, I'm Tori, an adult doll collector, and I create videos for other doll collectors and doll enthusiasts to enjoy. Today's video is not going to be very lighthearted and fun like most of my videos are, but I wanted to take you all along with one of my Reborn Art dolls to Walmart. We are doing our very last hurricane prep shopping trip. We have a major Cat 5 hurricane headed our way. We will be evacuating, but we needed to get all the food and supplies and everything that we needed to be able to evacuate. We will still be riding out this crazy storm, but we are going to a safer location to do so. This is extremely stressful. Now, as you'll see here in the video, our Walmart was out of almost all the water. We also got our hurricane alert here, as you can see on the screen, that popped up on everybody's phones while we were in Walmart. We already knew we were evacuating, but that's when we got the official mandatory evacuation. It's gonna be a bad one. Here's all of the paper products. Our Walmart already restocked this multiple times. By the time the storm gets here, or I should say the day before, this will be cleaned out. There will be nothing left. Walmart will have nothing in stock in the back anymore. Everything will be gone. Of course, I had to grab some fun hurricane snacks. I mean, come on. When you're going through a major hurricane, you gotta stress eat a little bit. <laughs> to anyone else who is feeling the impacts of this storm, Keep us updated in the comments on how you're doing. I will try my best to keep everyone updated on how me and my family are doing throughout this storm. Of course, I had to grab some more fall candy. When the last hurricane hit us just about two weeks ago, I picked up some of that candy and it's already gone. So yeah, I was stress eating a little bit last time too. <laughs> Now we're back home and I decided it's time to finish getting the rest of my doll collection prepared for this storm. Now most of my dolls are going to be packed up into watertight totes and put up as high as I possibly can in our house in case there is flooding. My reborn art doll collection, which are my one of a kind handmade dolls like Mr. Bennett here, get wrapped up in plush blankets and then stored in the waterproof totes. All of my other dolls, like my manufactured authentic dolls, such as Paradise Galleries, Ashton Drake Galleries, vintage dolls, etc. Those all sit on a shelf in my closet during these storms because they're a little more replaceable than my one of a kind pieces of artwork. Now this is the only doll that I'm taking with me when we evacuate. I usually take one doll with me when these things happen. This is Little Miss Reese, and she is currently my most important doll to me in my doll collection. I'm so happy that I'm able to take her with me. Now, a lot of people ask me, why don't you take your entire doll collection with you? Simple answer, we do not have space for that in our vehicle. My husband and I have several little kids and pets to have to get everybody's stuff into a little minivan, plus trying to fit any extra stuff is very, very difficult. So I'm more than happy to leave my dolls behind and take the most important things with me, which is my family and my pets. We are thinking of and praying for everybody else in the path of this storm as well. We are also thinking of everyone who just went through Hurricane Helene and um, suffered major losses from that. 
Let me know in the comments how all of you are doing, if you're also in the path of this storm or if you were in the path of the last storm. Thanks for watching everyone. I'll keep everyone updated as I can.